Hi Leo, welcome to the channel. Welcome to Angel Love 333. Hope all of you are doing well. We're gonna do your messages from Spirit and the angels. <laughs> Please know they're already popping out. Please know that this reading can be about any area in your life. So really just listen to the messages. You will know how they resonate with you. Also, just um, a couple things before we get started. Everything you need to know is in the description box. The only thing that I'll point out, if you're looking for a personal reading, uh, there is contact details below if you'd like to contact me. And there's some other options too, different readers that I have on my website. There's a spiritual advisor link below as well. So check it out if you like, and let's get started. We already had one card here drop out which is the wheel. It says new beginnings, end of delays, a change in direction that offers happiness. Okay, so this is that energy, right? Things going in your favor, some sort of change. Um, I also see it as a faded energy. Some of you could be closing out some sort of cycle in your life that's moving you in the right direction. Uh, and let's pull the bottom of the deck here. You also have the page of Raphael. An excellent opportunity will be offered to you. Scholarships or the pursuit of education, time to get to work. All right. So some of you, this could be some sort of financial assistance but that you've been hoping for. Um, but I'm going to say besides right around school or some sort of financial assistance, this is also my good news card, okay? So especially right there with the wheel, uh, I do feel like there could be some sort of message that you get or something happens, right? Um, it can't even be like a pay increase. It could also be right a sum of money that comes in. I'm going to say this also could be some sort of government uh, money that comes in for you as well. And then we also have here the Ten of Raphael. Love and blessings will fill your life, harmonious relationships with family members, and happily ever after. Okay. Some of you, this could be um, also a love relationship. You could get some sort um, of message. Maybe there hasn't been a whole lot of movement in your love life, right? Or you haven't really felt happy. Someone could send you a message right kind of uh, brighten up your day there and some of you i feel like there is um, some sort of good news here right that's going to make you really happy so let's pull the tarot we'll see where this energy is going you got two tens here so as it said end of delays new beginnings here so we'll see what the energy shows here for you all right thank you angels and spirit for your guidance what messages do you have for Leo? What is Leo needing to know? What is Leo needing to know? All right, we got the full card, new beginnings. Let's see what else we have here. We have the Knight of Cups. And we have the Four of Swords. And we have the Moon card. All right. So it's definitely showing me here. You got the full, you got the Knight of Cups. I feel like there's somebody here that's going to reach out to you here with this Knight of Cups. I see a new beginning here. Now, we have the Four of Swords and we have the Moon card. There's something about this, Leo. I feel like you feel, uh, maybe feel like there, there's some uncertainty here. I'm also going to say here, if this is around love, if you haven't been in a relationship or you're currently single, I feel like this is somebody that you don't know, okay? Somebody may be interested in you, and I feel like maybe you don't know this person. Um, I'm also going to say here, too, that this can be, right, fear. Um, you may be taking time to yourself to gain some clarity around your situation, Okay, let's pull some more cards uh, before we say any more and see what the energy shows here. I think I'm going to pull one more next to that Four of Swords before I pull the next row. Okay, so we got the Hierophant. All right, yeah, you know what? If this is around love and relationships, some of you I feel like it may it may be that it's been quite some time um, before since you've had like a stable or long-term relationship. So for some of you, I feel like this is a new person coming into your life, all right? 
Could be a Taurus here. We also have a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. This could also be right for some. This could be somebody you're in separation with, but it's not, not everybody is this going to be around love. So I'm going to say there could be some sort of good news. Um, there's something around, I feel like you could be questioning. Um, you got the Hierophant here with the Four of Swords. There's something around clarity, okay? There's something here that you're questioning. Maybe you've been waiting for uh, this good news or maybe a pay raise or something like that. Let's pull some more cards, see what else comes up here. What else can you share with Leo? Some of you, actually, it just came to me, actually, if this is not about love, even if it is about love, I feel like this is something that you've prayed for or you've meditated on this. That's what it is. Spirit gave it to me at the last minute. <laughs> All right, what else does Leo need to know? So yeah, this is some sort of um, something here I feel like you've been, you've been praying for or meditating or trying to manifest it. Okay, right, so we have the Nine of Pentacles. We have the Two of Wands. We have the Moon card. And look at that. We got the Four of Wands. Okay, and look at that. Yeah, some of you, this is around work and career. And what I'm going to say here, okay, I definitely get that there's some sort of uncertainty here. Okay, I feel like there's something here that you're uncertain about. Maybe you have questions. Some of you, if this is around a love relationship, there may be, right? Your emotions are involved here. But you have the full card and you have the nine of pentacles. Okay, so some of you, I feel here, some of you could be pursuing a new um, career. Maybe you are going back to school here with this Nine of Pentacles. Some of you may be getting some sort of financial assistance. Maybe you're starting some sort of side business here. If you are, it does feel like it will be very fruitful. Um, I'm also going to say here too, um, this I just feel here too. There's some sort of good news, some sort of change here that's happening in your life that's bringing a lot of happiness. And this is your well-being, and your well-being looks really good here, right? Being able to take care of yourself, uh, maybe even, right? It could even be from a friend or a child here, right? To go out and have some fun. Now, you have uh, the two of ones. There's some sort of offer, okay? Somebody here may be giving you some sort of invitation. Uh, somebody here, uh, maybe an, uh, an offer, I'm going to say if this is around career um, or a job situation, there could be a relocation here with the two of ones. There's some sort of decision here I see that you are uncertain about. Okay. Something is causing you a little bit of, of uncertainty here. But I would say it's probably just worry, your emotions um, you know, getting the best of you because you also have here the four of wands. So some of you, I feel like there's a new relationship or somebody, maybe somebody you know already who's interested, um, but you're a little worried about it. And, but I do feel like if this is a relationship, this could be something that goes long term. Okay. Now, if this is around job and career, I do feel like this could be very fruitful for you could be um, you know some extra income or more than what you're currently making to help your family you do have the eight of pentacles so i feel like you're going to be really focused here right on whatever this is for you okay whether it's going back to school some of you it could be a relocation some of you it's a job change and some of you this is around a relationship right so Leo, I think I'm just going to pull some more cards. I just feel like we need a little bit more clarity and then we'll get some guidance. What else can you show Leo about this? What else does Leo need to know about this? Now with that moon card, you could be dealing with the Pisces, a Cancerian, and we basically have all the energies on the board. Uh, the page of Ariel is Earth Energy. Okay, so we got the Five of Wands. We got the King of Cups. Yeah, there's something around your feelings, your emotions. I feel like you're struggling emotionally with something about this situation, okay? 
Let's see what you got. Page of Swords and the Sun card. Okay, so what they're showing you, I feel like there's some sort of internal struggle about making some sort of decision about this offer, all right? And I feel um, that is, right, what's causing the fear. So I feel like there could be some sort of bad experience you had, um, either similar to making some sort of change like this or, right, if it's a relationship, right, it could have to do with a bad experience you had with the relationship. But what I feel here, they're telling you with the Page of Swords and the Sun card, um, I feel like they're telling you to investigate this, right? Investigate the offer, get the clarity that you need, Um because right now it feels like fear may be getting the best of you, okay? Or it will when this offer is presented. There's something around you worrying about it. But what I'm going to say here, right on this four of wands and the hierophant, there's the sun card. This does show me there's potential here. There's potential for happiness and prosperity and joy here. And look, bottom of the deck here, you have the Ten of Pentacles. So definitely we have the Eight of Pentacles and the Ten of Pentacles. So if this is around money, career, I do feel like this could be something very prosperous for you. Or even if you're deciding right to go back to school, uh, maybe there's something you need to learn to get to the next level. Some of you would feel here too, right? Could be a promotion and a relocation. I do feel like it's going to work out very well for you with this eight and ten of pentacles. And some of you, if this is around a relationship, the decision may just be around, right? Do I want to put my focus, my time and effort into this? Okay. There's some sort of worry I feel around this for you, Leo. But I'm going to say, I feel like there's some good news coming, something that's going to make you happy. But there may be a little struggle around it. So let's see what the guidance is here for you, Leo. Okay, so we have discernment. All is not what it seems. Stay true to your knowing and keep your dreams a secret. Okay, so protect yourself, right? Protect your heart. Um, if there's an offer that's being presented, maybe don't tell anybody until you're sure what you want to do in the situation. And if you're, you know, it can be too, if you're starting a business, right? Until you exactly know what you want to do in your situation, I feel like they're saying kind of keep it to yourself, all right? I'm going to say here too, it says all is not what it seems. That's, that's the unknown there, right? So you may have some fears about the unknown or what's upcoming. So let's see what else we have for you. What other guidance do we have for Leo? Okay, so we have growth. Seek out a mentor or a guide. Take a ba take baby steps as you grow. Be willing to learn from others. Okay, so I feel like whatever this situation, it's part of your growth. And um, that may be what's a little bit scary, the change, right? Not knowing, right, if this is the best move for you in your situation. So they're telling you take baby steps, right? Be logical about this, right? The discernment energy is all logical, right? It's all your intellect. Um, it's not emotional, okay? So I feel like they're saying here, right? Detach emotionally and take uh, some baby steps. And bottom of the deck here, we have beloved. Prepare for your life partner, Romance is returning to your relationship. Believe you are lovable, okay? So some of you, this is around, right? A current relationship or some of you, you know, this is, uh, like I said, I feel like some somebody is coming towards you. So Leo, I hope uh, this reading helped you. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the day or evening. And I'm sending you angel love.